So the first thing I want to do when I have to initiate a reload is I bring the gun back and I actually index my elbow onto my rib cage and I slightly turn my gun so I can see the mag release and actually the mag opening. As I depress the mag release, my non-firing hand goes and makes sure that I have a spare magazine ready to go. When I depress the mag and the mag comes out, my new magazine's in, I can actually visualize and see it going in. I roll my hand up and I come back on target. Everything is done in my face box up here so I can see it, I can still see the targets. Tactically, it's a great thing to do because then you can see what's going on down range in a match. If my gun's up here, when I come back on target, it might be a quarter of a second faster than if I'm down here doing it, but you start adding up four or five reloads per stage, it starts to add up to a lot of time in a match. There's one more important aspect to consistent reloading. I've just removed a magazine from my pouch. I've seen a lot of people start doing this to find the next magazine. If I have to do another reload, I come down, I bring my hand right to the front, and I roll through to the next magazine to go in. Shoot, I come down, I roll through to the next magazine, and go in. So many people get screwed up trying to find their magazine. It's burning time, burning time. If we can consistently do the same motion every time, you're going to be a lot smoother in all your reloads. So let's go live fire and see the technique at speed. If you've ever shot a match, you know how important fractions of a second are. Learn to do a reload smooth and efficiently, and you'll gain a whole bunch of time.